Share the road is um, a shared responsibility. Uh, always ride defensively. And um What's up everybody? I'm Luke with Ride Bikes More and today I am in South Houston with Rocky. They invited me out to their uh, road bike ride. So we're gonna learn more about that. I haven't been on the road bike in a minute, so it's gonna be interesting. And remember to follow us on YouTube and Instagram if you don't already, because it makes you feel good. Mm. Rocky, tell us a little bit about the ride out here. They, Monty asked me to come out and learn more about it so that people that were interested can come and be a part of what you guys are doing out here. Okay, so we host a road ride uh, two nights a week, uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Thursday being our flagship ride is where we host the most events, uh, I'm sorry, the most groups, A, B, and C group. Uh, Tuesday is strictly C group. Uh, we start at 7 o'clock. Uh, we're here in Pasadena at the Vern Cox Recreation Center, and uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. Uh, we're in and out pretty quick. Uh, we roll at 7, and we're usually back here in the parking lot by 8.30. How can people find you on social media? We are on Facebook, we are also on Instagram, and we're also on Strava. What, what are the names on those um, places? All South Houston Cycling. South Houston Cycling. What are the miles per hour for those groups? Are these drop rides or no drop rides? How does that work? So uh, A and B group are drop rides. Uh, C group is a lot milder, uh, especially on Tuesday. Tuesday is kind of the day that we open it up for new talent to come out and experience what we're all about. Um, now, when you come out on Thursday, A group has an average of 24 miles per hour. So they're rolling 25 to 31 miles an hour. B group is rolling on a Strava average about 21 to 22 miles an hour. So they're rolling 23 to 25. Um, your C group, we will roll anywhere from 15 to 18 miles an hour and do a couple sprints on a 20 mile route. So for someone that's out there that's wanting to come and be a part of this, should they reach out to you first? Should they come out here? What, uh, what tips would you give them before they come out? Um, first thing I would do is make sure their bike is in good shape. That's number one. Uh, number two, uh, ask around. Uh, we're, we're fairly popular. People know who we are on the road scene. <clears throat> if it sounds like something <clears throat> you want to get into, uh, send us a DM. Uh, we'll answer within five to ten minutes. Uh, we'll give you a good direction on what it is you need to do or where you need to be. Um, if you need some individual coaching, we can offer that as well. Great. About how many people are we expecting tonight on the, the ride? Any given night, we average uh, ten people per group. So we're hosting all three groups tonight. We should have about 30 people here tonight. The summer gets a lot more popular. We average about 15 people per group. So you'll see anywhere from 45 to 50 people out here. Did you already mention how many miles this ride will be? C Group uh, runs 20 miles uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Uh, the A and B Group run 23 miles. Is there any message that you want to give to the people that are watching? Yeah, uh, share the road is um, a shared responsibility. Uh, always ride defensively and uh, have fun. Any shout outs you want to give? Absolutely. Want to give a shout out to the Hard Varks who also ride down here. I uh, want to give a shout out to the SH Toxicas. I uh, also want to give a shout out to Primo's Taco House, who hosts a lot of our rides. I uh, want to give a shout out to uh, Slow Twitch Niche in Seabrook. That's a bicycle shop. I want to give a shout out to Bay Area Cycling as well. Uh, they're on Ritchie and South Houston. And Mom. Hi, Mom. Great. Rocky, I really appreciate it. For Ride Bikes More, I'm Luke, and we are out.